This is a scam I've told you about before. The FBI is calling it the phantom hacker scam. It's also known as the remote access scam. It involves convincing victims that their financial accounts have been hacked. The goal is to get people to move their money into an alias account, and that's where the scammers go in and they steal the money. According to the FBI, scammers will gain victims' trust in three phases in this scam. First, they pose as a tech support representative, and they convince you to download a piece of software onto your machine. That gives them remote access to your device. And then they call a second time, pretending to be from the victim's bank or another financial institution, and direct you to move your money to a government entity, so-called for safety. And finally, then they claim to be an employee of a federal agency. And they may even provide an official-looking document to appear legitimate. This scam can come in many forms, including emails, texts, phone calls, and even letters sent in the mail. So to protect yourself, remember, never respond to requests for information unless you initiated that request. I'm Brian Roach on your side, WGAL News 8.